Hey, welcome back to the Quintessential Bachelor. And as you can see, I'm sitting at the bar. So that should tell you, um, it is five o'clock. So that means it is the green hour. And today we're gonna be talking about Killian Lehervert, meaning green hour. So uh, the green hour was when uh, the nobility got together and they drunk a uh, 1970s uh, liqueur that was created by uh, the doctor Pierre Ordinaire. And uh, this scent conveys that very well. It, it brings about the myth and the controversy of the drink absinthe, which was made with uh, wormwood. So, uh, this, uh, the only other fragrance that I can think of that even has absinthe in it, that's in the Killian line, is uh, Taste of Heaven. But this one here is, uh, has a prof profundity, profundity, and um, it's, it's an all-around very curious fragrance. Uh, it's a noble, very, very, very noble fragrance, and how they made the drink, uh, it's a French Parisian drink. Uh, you would take one ounce of absinthe, uh, a French, um, uh, so French cup that's shaped like this uh, called a partelet, and then uh, you would put a perforated spoon with the sugar over it, and then um, you have what is called a balancier, and you set that on top of it with ice cold water, and it releases a little bit into the drink and a little bit over to the sugar that melts it into the absinthe. Uh, absinthe was banned for a long time in the United States. So, you know, with this, you have a, uh, you get a crisp citrusy drink when you're drinking a drink, but there's no real citrus in this. But what you do get is uh, some licorice, star anise. Uh, you also get the, um, the cypress, the violet leaf, and then to round it out in the bottom, you get the patchouli and the vanilla. Nothing else in the Killian lineup smells like this. Killian dug deep into his uh, heritage because he's from the Hennessy family. He dug deep into the heritage of the uh, liqueur family that is the Hennessy family to create this. This right here is uh, it's definitely, it's polished. This is for the dapper, polished, uh, high value male. This, women like this also. So this could go unisex. You can wear this year round and this is not your typical fragrance from the liqueur line. This is not like Angel Share. This is not like the uh, Apple Brandy on the rocks. This does not have the on the rocks accord. And I like this. This is like a totally new creation. Of course, they went with the same typical uh, bottling and the same typical presentation for the liqueurs line, of course. But this fragrance right here uh, stands completely apart from uh, anything else. And uh, I think this was the proper setting to talk about this one right here. So, hey, this is... Uh, this is coming out tomorrow. It is uh, this is September fifth. This drops September sixth, and well, being September sixth is a holiday. And, well, y'all saw when I bought this. I bought this on the fourth, but um, yeah, this drops on the sixth. But being that the sixth is a holiday, you probably won't be able to get your hands on this until the seventh. But hey, this is this is uh, well crafted. There's a mystique about it. Mm. And you know, there's a lot of depth in this. It's, it's uh, inner reaching, a lot of depth. And uh, I like this one out of that whole liqueurs line. I think this is the best one. I've, I've worn it already and uh, you know, I got already got compliments on it. Now the proje projection is not far reaching, but you get a decent amount of projection. And also the uh, the longevity uh, come the seventh hour, 
there's gonna be time to reapply, but it's not overpowering. So you can apply, you know, multiple times during the day. You can apply this, but uh, it has enough strength that warm weather, cold weather, you'll be able to pull this off. But I would say save this for your more uh, upscale events or your outings. Don't this shouldn't be your everyday wear. Save this one. Uh, if you want the everyday wear, go with either the Angel Share or the Apple Branding on the Rocks, which I will also be doing a review on real soon. I did my first impressions, but uh, my bottle hadn't come yet. I got mine straight from Killian, and you know when they send when people send me stuff, it seems like it's been getting lost in the mail. So <laughs> it might have got lost in the mail. Plus it was holidays, so hey, I don't know. So when I get it, I'll shoot the review out, but. A lot of people hadn't done the review on this one here and I wanted to talk about the green hour so let me put this on skin oh my god you can smell that freshness it's not a it's not an overpowering freshness you can smell the the licorice or the star anise note mm. Then that sweetness from that vanilla and that patchouli picks in it. And the, the cypress and the violet leaf. Oh my god. This, this blends so well. And the sweetness is not, like I said, it's not overpowering. So it doesn't make it, lay, doesn't make it lean uh, feminine or masculine. I think a female could also pull this one off. It's not like the apple brandy. I don't think a woman can pull the apple brandy off. But this one, well, yeah, ladies, y'all can pull this one off. Mm. This is definitely a 10 out of 10 cent um, from the uh, Killian line. I didn't know if I was going to like it or not. So that's why I went for the apple brandy first. And, of course, uh it hadn't showed up yet, so I ran out and got this one. Uh, I got this one at Cosper. They actually did get it early, so uh, but it wasn't supposed to be out yet. It's not supposed to come out till the 6th, and like I say, the 6th is a holiday, so it will probably be the 7th before you can get your hands on this, unless you can reach out to Cosper or uh, Saks Fifth Avenue, or you can see if you can get it online. I have mine coming from Killian, so like I said, I don't, I don't know how that's going to work out. So uh, when I get it, then I'll do the review. But I got this one at Cost Bar. So hey, y'all go holler at the people over at Cost Bar and they can hook you up. But yeah, this, this is an A-plus rated fragrance. So hey, I'm loving it. This is going to be my scent for the day. I'm going to enjoy myself here. And hey, y'all keep watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Love y'all to death. Appreciate it. Oh,